service will begin in 10 minutes. Please convene at the gate prior to that time. Ha! That's cool! Sonic! When did you learn those techniques? <laughs> Not very impressive for someone of your reputation. No, I've checked you out, actually. Not bad. I admit you're pretty fast on your feet. But here, it's a whole different story when riding with extreme gear. You see, to be the fastest on a gear, you have to become one with the wind. Without wings, well, you might as well kiss the ground and go home. Who does he think he is? Hmm. Well, I don't think he's all talk, you know. I better be on my toes during this competition. I never, I never imagined, imagined anyone, anyone would anyone enter the would race, enter the with, race such with such a piece of piece junk. Of junk. Sorry, Sonic. I just need to fine-tune a few things, then your extreme gear will be at a hundred percent. Hey, Tails, you always do your best, so don't worry. Yeah, but she has a point. She's a really brilliant mecha mechanic. Sonic, don't worry, I'll unlock the secret of the extreme gears for us. Hey everyone, this is Nintendo Game Company welcoming you back to Sonic Riders. So yeah, um, last part we uh, pretty much finished three tracks of AR story, which is pretty much half of it. So we're pretty much a quarter of the way done with the game. Like I said, this game goes by really quick. Um, but yeah, we're playing as Tails once again. So yeah, I think I explained most of everything on the last part. So, like, it took me like that entire part to explain all the basics. But yeah, oh, one, one thing I don't think I mentioned is different ways you can get air. I mean, I said like you could do tricks or use uh, different powers. Um, but yeah, with all, by doing uh, tricks or using your character's powers like uh, going and flying through air rings or plowing through things, you'll, uh, get, you'll, you'll fill up your air gauge a little. But yeah, there's actually a little shortcut here, but I missed it the first time. Um, it'll just basically, uh, jump you up to a web. And sometimes I get it right, or sometimes I can't. Like it, like that web there. It, it, you'll, uh, you know, it's, it's just a little shortcut. But uh, yeah, like I said, sometimes I miss it. Sometimes I can get it. But yes, um, there's really not much more to explain of this game. I, I think I covered it all. I mean, I may have missed something, but. Uh, yeah, this is Tails, so... Honestly, this game takes a lot of getting used to. Um, in the... In the Aero Store, I actually didn't have that much uh, trouble, except for... a few tracks. Where I, uh... lose. But, uh, you know, like I said, that there, that was a shortcut. But, uh... And you can probably already guess who the um, what the other story is that we'll be unlocking. So yeah, but uh, on the final track in this race, I actually have a lot of trouble. But uh, yeah, of course I did all my uh, losses. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can also get air by doing this, like. Whenever it shows the analog stick there, just rotate it and you'll gradually get some air back. But yeah. Um, but yeah, that was the, um, what was that track's name again? Uh, well, I forgot what it was called, but yeah, that was, um, the fourth track of the air story. Uh, so, here's the next cutscene. Now our race has reached its final stage. The remaining competitors are pacing, anxious for the race to begin. Only a few minutes left. 
wasn't due to your skills. <laughs> I won't lose now. <laughs> Get ready. It's time for the final race to begin. All right, you may think this is actually the final race of the your story, but it's really not. Spoilers. But uh, you have to beat Jet. Um, I think it was wrong as part of I said most of the heroes uh most of the hero story you have to get uh, just in the top three. I believe that's only like the first two tracks. I might be wrong, but I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. But yeah. Um, like here, um, Jet will always uh, finish in front of uh, Tails and Knuckles. There's no way you'll get to third or fourth place. But, uh, yeah. So you basically have to get in first place here. Yes, yeah, so I remember when I first played this, I like had a lot of trouble with this track. I don't know why it seems real easy for me to get through it now. I mean, I think I do pretty good in this uh, track. I mean, I hardly bump into anything. And... I don't know, I stay in first place like the whole time. So I think it's been that way through um, last part too. Like all, all the other tracks. But yeah. Um, that next uh, track though, I had a lot of trouble with. I don't know why. Just. I've, but uh, yeah, I, I don't know why. I kept Family. But uh, we'll get to that when we get to it. Um, yeah. I haven't mentioned how much I was annoyed. I might forget there's a way to turn him off. I don't think you can turn him off in the storm mode though. But I just wish I could uh, turn his voice off. So, but, yeah. Yes, um, there's like three new characters introduced to the series, um, Jet the Hawk, uh, Wave the Swallow, and Storm the Albatross, I believe, um, but they're only ex exclusive to the Sonic Riders series. It, it really wouldn't be fitting if they paired any Sonic Adventure games, I don't think. Just leave them in. Sonic Riders, but uh, yeah, we are actually about to finish the final lap, so enjoy this good scene.
dirt suits you so well. Babylon Garden. <laughs> now I'll get the treasure of Babylon. So here we are at the final uh, track of the hero story. So, yeah, we're already there. Just about halfway through the game, pretty much. Then we'll uh, head on over to the uh, Babylon story. I might as well say it now. But, uh, yeah. It's, here, it's pretty obvious what that story is. But, uh, yeah. For some reason, this track. Give me a lot of life and screw up in this footage I have here, but still win. But uh, you'll see that later on. I like, uh, screw up twice and somehow still win. But uh, yeah, this track isn't that bad. It's probably one of the hardest in the game, but uh, I don't find it all that terrible. Yes, um. Okay, th this wall over here with the uh, grind rail. Sometimes I swear you could just miss that grind rail and bump into the wall, which will slow you down and you'll miss that rail. And yeah, I actually do that in the final lap. Final lap. But yeah, sometimes in these sharp turns I can just fall. I could like, I don't know. I kept failing and bumping into stuff and falling out. It's just horrible. But uh, yeah. But 
This game is pretty easy to me now. So, since I've gotten used to it, I mean... When I got back into the game like a few months ago, I just kept losing over and over again. But then you know, I got used to it and I can't breathe now. But yeah, um, it's probably my favorite of the Sonic Rider series. I mean, I, I never actually played uh, Free Riders, but uh, I'm probably not going to. I heard, I, I heard that the uh, controls, the, the, the con using the connect with that game is just horrible, so. Probably never getting that. I don't want to. But yeah, I don't even have an Xbox, so I can't even get it anyway. As for Zero Gravity, I find that game to be pretty good. Not as good as this one, but uh, it's still fun. I might LP that sometime, but if I do, it probably won't be for a while. So yeah, we're already on the final lap. And this is where I screw this up. See? But yeah. I mean, it didn't slow me down all that much, but still. It could. Just that little, one little mess up could ruin the whole race for you. And then I fall down there, and somehow I still win the race. But yeah, that does it for the hero storyline, so yeah, here we, here's the uh, final uh, cutscene for this story. Enjoy. your pity, nor do I need it! What? Are you crazy? If they don't want it, then let's take it. Treasure is treasure. Uh, I think it's time to leave now. Tails? Yeah! Sonic! Amy? Well, Amy, I thought it'd be okay with you, and, uh... This is it for the hero story, so yeah. Um, we see, even though we see the credits here, we're not done with LP. We still have the other story to go. So, yeah. Um, gotta love the cutscenes in this game. I mean, the story's really not needed, and 
for this type of game, but uh, it's there. I find the cutscene to be interesting. But yeah, I just get to the credits here, so we'll be seeing them anyway after uh, Babylon's story. But yeah, here we unlocked a lot of stuff. Mish mode. Awesome. Green, Rouge, Shadow, yeah. Even though those characters aren't actually in the story, we still play as them in like the normal mode and all that. But yes, we are finished with uh, the hero story, and next we'll be doing uh, basically Team Babylon. So yeah, this is Nintendo Game Cup, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.